Greetings, my Mo Maniacs! This is Panzerman Bill, Panzerman's Bunker, coming to you with a on the bench model building review. Oh, 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 oh! Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Alright, fellas, starting the new year off. Uh, this is actually a build I finished last year, but I just got around to doing the video. Got a little backlog of stuff, so I'll be sending some more videos out soon, but, uh, Let's jibber jabber, flipper flabber, let's go on to it. <laughs> Alright, what you see here is the Academy kit of the 35T. This is a captured uh, Czechoslovakian um, arms industry tank that the Germans took over. Uh, this along with the 38T, this is the 35T, the Academy kit, and it's done up as a Biobachtwagen, you know, command tank. And it's done up as a uh, Polish campaign tank with a very early war German gray and brown camouflage pattern on it. This was a good kit. I did this for an Amps Review Crew build. If you want to go see the full build from opening the box all the way to the end, you go to amps-armor.org, go to reviews, Full build reviews and look for my name and 35T tank by Academy and you'll find that there. All right, just let you know this is a pretty it was a pretty good kit, but Academy did come out with 35T earlier, like two years before this, and it's basically the exact same kit except with the earlier re release they had a uh, whole bunch of jerry cans on the back deck, and that was it. There's only difference. This has the uh, bed frame antenna. A command tank has, and the other one had jerry cans. It's the only difference. It's the only difference. So, just to let you know and be heads up about that. As a review build, you're supposed to do it just out of box and you know grade the uh, kit as it as it comes to you. But you can change certain things for accuracy. So I want to draw your attention to a couple things here. Yeah, Bill, you told me uh -huh. some accuracy stuff. Yeah, that's right. Here, heard. You must have accuracy. Um, the kit supply jack, I hate when they give the brackets as a solid molding across the, you know, the actual surface of the jack, so I, I cut that free and made separate brackets for the jack just because I didn't like the way it looked. Dinged up the muffler a little just to give it some character. And the only other real changes I made was the hatch interior detail here and for the driver was plain. So I did mold a little bit better cushion here and did some brackets and stuff for accuracy off the actual kit. Same thing down here. I molded the uh, pad padding better and put some latching latches and stuff on the inside here. And the uh, crew figures, they nice. They give you two crew figures, but uh, they give you a chance, uh, choice of the early beret type headdress or the uh, garrison cap. So since it's early war, I went with the berets. I did add the uh, headphone antenna wire, and I give him better arms because the kit figure had bad arms. Give him a pistol. Same thing down here. I just added a goggle and some wires for the headphones. Also, being a command tank, they gave you an antenna here, but they didn't give you an antenna here for the tactical. So just get yourself a piece of sprue. I added that. Other than that, it's totally out of box. It was a nice build. You go to the AMP site and check out my full build review of this. I go over all the shortcomings and some problems I encountered. But in general, it was, a, it was a pretty fun kit to build. So I encourage you to check it out. If you're in an early war German armor, this might be the kit for you to build. As you're looking, you might see a couple glue shines I've got yet to clean up. But I'll get this ready for a competition this upcoming year. That's it. That's it. Early war, invasion of Poland, 35T German tank. Yeah, looking good. That's right, Herr Hurt. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> All right, fellas. Keep building. Keep having fun out there. Till next time, Panzerman Bill, Panzerman's Bunker saying, I'll be the same, my diamond and heron. Woo! Waka waka. So you can see Grendel. He's over there sleeping. You guys see him? Grendel's over there sleeping. Little Posh is having a snooze. Right, Grendel?
<laughs> All right, fellas. Let's have a good year in the YouTube community. I'm psyched. I'll be talking with you fellas later. Tschüss. Waka waka.